So you clicked on this video looking at the title because you probably feel hopeless. You feel like you've tried everything, drop shipping, drop servicing. You even started an agency. Maybe you have an agency right now, but there's things you're not good at. You're not that good at lead generation, uh, getting them on calls or converting the client from prospect to actual sale, right? Well, there's one thing I'm going to show you guys uh, today that if you plug it in today, put action into it, and you can make money this week. And it does not matter your level of skill. So if you already have an agency, this is going to be extremely powerful for you as well. Uh, as always, guys, I have have the going to go over the script as well um so let's get straight to it so this is how you can make money online this week even if you are having trouble with that right now you might be struggling and everything so what we're going to do is we're going to partner with other talented people have you guys ever heard of a book called who not how okay it's all about leverage if you ever read a book called how to grow rich uh using leverage that book will help you as well i don't have some affiliate link or nothing for that but guys leverage whatever you don't know how to do someone else is good at that instead of using the spirit of pride and jacking ourselves up and holding ourselves back we can leverage people. You don't just leverage money. You don't just leverage credit. You can leverage other people. And what I mean by that is stop looking at agencies, other agencies as competition and start looking at them as collaborators. So take your best skill, okay? What is your best skill? What is your service that you offer? You might be offering AI automation, right now you might be offering SEO. So right here, I asked ChatGBT, to uh, create a list of every type of marketing agency that a beginner could start or if you already are in one. And it gave me a list, a whole bunch of crap, right? But anyway, digital marketing agency, content marketing agency, uh, social media agency, email agency. So what are we going to do? We're going to fill in the potholes, okay? We're going to fill in the voids, all right? Make these other agencies run way smoother, by offering our service. Why? So that whenever they get a client, you get a client. So you're plugging yourself in. Have you ever saw those um, National Geographic Shark Week type videos or whatever, when the shark will be swimming, right? And it'll be these little tiny fish that's on the side of the shark. The shark doesn't attack them or anything like that. They just live on the body of the freaking shark. Why? Because it's way easier to just wait for the shark. You know for sure you're making a guarantee to eat because the shark is going to eat. So if you're just hanging out by the shark's mouth, then you're going to get you're going to get bits and pieces of whatever the shark is eating. It's a simple plan. So guess what? Look at these other agency owners, uh, marketing agency owners as sharks, right? And whenever they eat, if you're the little fish that's on the side of them. I know, y'all, it sounds weird, but if you're the little fish that's on the side of them, you're going to get clients as well. So we're going to go over to Google, and I'm going to show you what I'm talking about. All right. So, but let's see. We're going to pick an email marketing agency. Then we're going to pick an SEO agency. Then we're going to pick uh, an in influencer marketing agency. Now, watch this. Look, okay. So we go over here. We're going to type in email marketing agency Los Angeles. Nope, nope, nope. We don't want digital because digital mean they do pretty much everything. So let's see. All right. So we got London. All right. That's cool. All right. So basically what you want to do is you want to type in uh, email marketing agency. Then we're going to put in gmail right here dot com put that in quotations then we're going to press enter all right so what is it did, did is going to give us the gmails of all of the email marketing agencies in in london pretty much like you know so as you can see look at the look at the uh, google so you'll see the gmail right there you'll see his gmail right there so we can just simply press command and press a 
All right, and then we copy that and we'll do this for all of the pages pretty much. And then we paste it over here on uh, chat GPT, right? Then we say uh, extract all content, I mean, contact, or we'll say our company names, uh, phone numbers, and gmails from this content and put it in a csv format all right so after this i'm going to show you the script right because you want to be a value of these people so you'll do this with a couple of the pages you can have uh why is it doing it like this oh my god anyway um Usually it'll just, here, how about this? Just give it to me in a regular format, okay? Let's see, because I don't know why I did that. Uh, okay, so it's starting to do that, blah, 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 blah. Okay, so now you got the Gmails, you got the phone numbers, you got all of that extra stuff, right? So what are you going to do when you reach out to them? So like I said, you want to fill in a void, all right? A lot of people don't understand because a lot of gurus will tell you, recommend to you, if you want to make a lot of money fast, you need to niche down, niche, niche, niche down, zone in on one service, one offer and all of that. And that can work, right? But there are other markets that are open and you're leaving money on the table. Now, focus, focus and zone in. But guess what? If you make partners with other people that do these other services, then you can still stay focused on your email marketing agency, right? Or if you have an AI automation agency, you can still stay focused on getting your AI automation clients. It doesn't cost you any more time, effort or money or staff to add an SEO sector because that partner, that other SEO agency, every time you get someone that says, okay, you did my AI automation, um, you know, but can you help me with, with SEO too? Instead of you saying, oh, I'm sorry, we don't, we don't do that and turning down some perfectly good money, right? You can say, oh, sure. And then now you just lead them to the page. Oh, just click on the tab for SEO on our site. And now it's going to send that person to the SEO agency, right? And that partner is going to handle the SEO. They're going to get the $5,000 a month retainer, but then they're going to kick you down fifteen dollars to $2,000 out of that, depending on what the agreement is. And you don't even have to do anything, any of the fulfillment or nothing, right? All it took was you creating an extra page on your site, right? Or them create you getting them to okay so now i pretty much gave the game away so once we got all of these emails like you can go through this is ai scraping tools that can do this but i just wanted to show y'all a free way of getting uh scraping these emails and everything just in case you don't have the tool right pause all right so now we come over here this is the email y'all all right so as you can see it says partnership email to send other agencies so basically you want to fill in where they have voids whatever they don't do you can do and even if you don't know how to do it it's probably a cheap fiber gig for it okay so you you don't even have to do the fulfillment right so watch this if you sent this out today versus trying to go and get clients from scratch or something like that you're going to get a good response because these guys are the sharks. They're out all the time prospecting, trying to get clients, running ads and stuff. That means you're leveraging their ad budgets. You're leveraging their hours of prospecting. You're leveraging every time they're on a call trying to close somebody. You're leveraging that because one, once they do the fulfillment for whatever service they have, if you guys are partners, now they can just recommend to that client that they have. Yo, also... We have SEO. The dude is named David, right? <laughs> and now they pass them off to you and vice versa. Like you create a page on your site for what they do. And you guys are just referral swapping. And nobody really has to do too much marketing. Right? Okay, so look at this. This is the subject. 
it would be smarter if you did this manually, but I know in this marketing world, we want to do the AI stuff and do things in bulk. So it can still work in bulk. So we'll say uh, exciting partnership opportunity for your agency. But if you're doing this personally and manually, then you'll say exciting partnership opportunity for blank agency, fill in the blank. Okay, so now we got, hey, yo, in my DMX voice right here. Okay, hey, yo. That's uh, then we have the agency name right here. Then we always want to start off making it about them. All right. We always want to make it about them because it is about them. I mean, it's about the partnership, but people will know what you want, you know, and how they can get something from it. Okay. So we start off with this your blank agency site. And I put blank because this, you know, this is going to vary depending on what type of agency you have and what type of agencies you're targeting. Okay. So if they're an AI agency, let's we'll say your AI automation agency site is better than blank. I always tell you guys to name drop, either name drop some, uh, a famous brand in the industry or name drop a close related competitor. All right. What do I mean by that? Okay. So if I was saying, all right, we ain't got no snack pack for this, do we? Okay. Oh, that's because I got this right here. All right. So watch this. All right. Um, where's the snack pack for this? Jesus. London, you suck. Okay, let's go to Los Angeles. Let's just say digital marketing agency. All right. So if I'm sending a uh, code digital an email, I would say. Uh, your AI automation agency, let me get to this, has better AI automation results <laughs> than Canesta Digital Marketing or um, um, Website Depot, okay? So you, we went to your website and you have better results than them. Like we like your testimonials that you have. We, it looks like you take care of your clients and, and get, get, have a good reputation. So this lets them know that we both checked out there. We took the time to check out their site. And even if we didn't, by naming their competitor, it looks like we did, okay? So they're feeling the personalization and everybody wants to be better than their competition. Everybody does. So by putting that right there is letting them know that you chose them over the competition. It says, which is why I'm emailing you. Now, we want to talk money. I didn't even put the money in here, uh, but you guys can modify that, okay? And I'll show you where to put the money in a minute. You always want to talk money to people because that's all they care about. Money, sex, fun, drugs, lust, all of that extra stuff, okay? All right, so your blank agency site is better than can can you agency site which is why i'm emailing you but you don't have a page for blank you don't have a page for seo which is what we do now you're just hitting straight to the juggler vein letting them know you ain't even trying to get no money right you ain't trying to sell nothing to them allow me to add a page for that seo and i'll take care of all the work plus split this new passive income stream with you i guess i did put money in there but you know uh you might want to add some type of number like yo if if you um if if three or four people add you i mean ask you about seo this month instead of telling them now nah, we don't do that too you can just pass them to this page right here that's on your site right you're not even taking them away from your site. You're going you're gonna to get all the full credit for it pretty much. So you pass them to this page right here. And if I'm charging $5,000, you know what I'm saying, uh, uh, per client for SEO, and I pass you off uh, two grand out of that, two times five clients, you, you, you can do the math, right? There's a lot of money. So you can put the 10 grand right up on there. In the in the email right there. So like, damn, that's an extra 10 grand. I've been passing up. You understand what I'm saying? Like, damn, just by adding a page to my site, which only takes five minutes, I can actually have an extra income stream that I don't even have to do the work for, right? So that's awesome, right? So it says also, now we let them know on top of that, 
when we get blank clients, which is SEO, uh, I mean, when we get SEO clients that ask about AI automation, oh, what's this AI stuff that everybody's buzzing about? Can you do our AI chatbots? Instead of us saying, I, we don't do that, we will send them your way. So it's a win-win. This partnership uh, can be set up in just five minutes and you'll start getting referrals in no time for free. Thursday and Friday at 6 p.m. Central is open for me. Which day is best to team up? Once again, you decide. You make the time frames and everything like that. Never ask yes or no questions either. Don't say, yo, uh, are you interested in this partnership? They're going to say no. Um, don't say, um, <laughs> Uh, do you like this or or, or can we do this or uh, can you get on the call or nothing? No, use, learn, practice using which, when, how, who, what, you know what I'm saying? That type of stuff. You hear me? Like which. So I gave them choices, letting them know I'm a busy man too. So I said Thursday and Friday at 6 p.m. Central is open for me. Which day is best to team team up? So it don't sound like I'm trying to sell anything to them because technically, I mean, as far as money goes, I'm not trying to sell anything to them. Uh, I'm actually trying to hand them money. If you uh, create income streams for, uh, if you create new income streams for other people, then they'll chop you off a piece of it. So is is that symbiotic relationship like we were talking about with the shark? The shark doesn't even notice those little situ uh, those little fish anymore. They keep him clean all day while he's swimming and stuff, and they get to eat all day while he's swimming and stuff. So it's a perfect unity, all right. So which day is best to team up? The verbiage is is very important. You understand? Like use words like that when you're talking to other agencies because they can be your collaborators instead of your competition. You get way more money with collaborators than you get trying to stump off competition unless you know how to create monopolies and most of y'all don't, okay? All right, so um, in the description or the first pinned comment of this video, we have Agency to Partner. That's a membership program where we show agencies that get clients how to get partners and pull six figures sometimes annually, sometimes per month out of one partner instead of charging just some set retainer being stuck there having to get a million clients and stuff like that. So if I were you, I strongly suggest that that membership be part of my plan by clicking the link in the first pinned comment. Love you guys. Go ahead and take action in this. You can make some money with this real quick. Love you.